So once you have a size determined for your product, the first step will be to download a template from our website. On our website, we have a resources tab with all of our standard sizes, and you can download a PDF template for the corresponding size. Um, you'll open that template in whatever program you're using. We highly recommend Adobe Illustrator as that's what we use in-house, um, and that will look something like this. On the template, it's gonna have markings for all of the print uh, specifications, the zipper, hang hole, all the fold lines, everything like that. So it will be apparent when you're placing the artwork onto the template. Um, you'll want to put the front, the back, and the gusset if you're doing a stand-up pouch onto the template. Um, for this design here, I have an example of how that should be displayed within the template um, here. And then before you save the, the final file, you'll want to remove the template um, from the PDF and the final artwork file should contain both the front, back, and gusset areas and then that is converted into a final pouch here. Um, some things to keep in mind when designing your artwork are going to be the placement of the zipper, the hang hole, the side seals, everything like that. This example is how we print the film behind me here um, and you'll notice that it, it is a continuous print and so when we go to cut the pouches, it is best if you can have a seamless pattern or a solid color as when we go to cut, if this side of the pouch is a different color from the opposite side, there may be a little bit of that color showing um, on the opposite side of the pouch and that it is part of our production tolerances.